Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedi again. Today we're going to keep working with our Pro Tools video series. So today I have a, a function that I think is more like a trick. Okay, this is a trick that's going to be really useful when you're um, at the pre-production stage of a song, uh, when you're starting to try to sketch ideas for, for an actual production, and this is going to save you a lot of time. And this is called the tap tempo function. So let's say that you want to know, um, like you have a, you have a, you know, you have a guitar, let's say an acoustic guitar, right? And you have some, some chords and you have a chord progression and you've been playing with, you know, strumming to those chords and you want to set a click so that you can record that guitar to the click. Well, how do you know how fast is that song? Well, you would need someone to play it, right? Uh, so you would get someone in the room next to you to start playing the song. And while that person plays, you can tap the tempo using your click from your mouse to set the exact tempo of the metronome or the click. How do you do that? Well, um, as you can see here, I have a click track. And if you go to the very first, the start of the song, there is a tempo marker here. This little red um, arrow, you double click there. And then here where it says BPM, this, by the way, this is a tempo change um, window. Uh, where it says BPM, as you can see, 155, that's currently highlighted. But if you press T, right, like 1, 2, 3, 4, as you could see, that literally calculated how fast or how spaced those four um, beats were, and it calculated, and the number that it gave was 89. So if you keep playing... It'll calculate, and in real time, it'll tell you what's that tempo. So if you would have someone playing the guitar, you could, you know, tap it once again, just pressing the letter T on your keyboard, like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So that's around 66, 67. So once you have it, you just press OK, and the tempo just changed to that. Once again, you double click on that red arrow. And then you can tap it, pressing T. Let's do something faster. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, 137. Then I press OK. And the tempo just changed to 137. So if I press play, three, four. One, two, three, four. Right? If we do it again, we do it slower. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, 82. Press OK. Let's listen to it. One, two, three, four. So you get the idea, right? So once again, very fast, very useful, especially when you're starting to uh, work on the pre-production of a song. So that's your tap tempo function in Pro Tools. I hope this was helpful. If you have any other questions, please call us from BDM PC Audio Labs, and we're going to be happy to help you. We'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye. Want to learn how to produce music using this, or using that, or using all of these? Have you been watching videos, reading manuals, blogs, and trying to figure out everything that it takes to be a music producer? Do you have a bunch of music gear that you purchased and you still haven't made any music? Well then you need Obedia, the world's only one-on-one -on -one digital audio training and tech support service. Check out the link below for a special new subscriber offer.